welcome to middle town it is sunday morning everyone is there at the market the market is busy today there is a new man at the market his name is mr poot his daughter is helping him her name is sara good morning mr poot says to everybody my fruit is fresh my fruit is cheap mr poot is polite everybody like mr poot what a nice man they say everybody like his daughter they say his school boy asks for 1 kilo of apples mr poot some apples on the scales the scales show 1 kilo and 200 grams mr poot takes one apple away now the scales show 800 gram but mr poot says 1 kilo of apples 1 dollar he take 1 dollar from the school boy sara is watching her father she sees everything a young man asks for 2 kilos oranges mr poot put some oranges on the scales the scales show 2 kilos and 300 gram mr poot takes one orange away now the scales show 1 kilo and 100 grams mr poot says 2 kilos of oranges 2 dollar he take 2 dollar from the young woman sara sees everything it is sunday evening sara's father is counting his money he is happy but sara is not happy father you must sell the correct way our customers are poor but we are poor too sara my wife is dead you have no matter i have no sons you have no brothers we must make money sara i don't want to work at the market father we must eat your child you don't understand business you are woman that's life sara it is monday morning today sara's father is selling the correct weight he is honest he take the correct money he is proud of her father the customers are very happy too they buy a lot of fruits your fruit is cheap and fresh they say but in the afternoon some customers come back they are angry an old man brings back some apples one of his apples is bad look mr fruit your fruit isn't fresh today we want our money back but mr fruit doesn't listen he doesn't give them any money i don't want to work for you i don't want at the market but you must work for me sara says her father i have no family i have no wife and no sons children must help their parents you my daughter sara you must work for me that's life no father says sara i do not want to clean your house i want to leave home i do not want to cook your food i want to get a good job sara's father is angry go to bed he shout at sara goes to bed she says a prayer please help me please help me my father what am i going to do i need a miracle help me it is tuesday morning everybody is at the market something strange is happening mr fruit touches an apple the apple goes bad then he picks up the orange goes bad too everybody laugh look at mr fruit mr fruit look at his hand what is happening he says please sara help me sara touches an apple and some bananas yeah ye everybody says it's a miracle sara touches fruit and it's okay we are going to buy fruit from sara next year mr fruit is miss fruit sara is honest she doesn't cheat she always sells the correct weight sara is making a lot of money she has a good job now he cleans the house he cooks the food that's love he says okay